Branson is full of great shows and attractions you could drive right past and never know. Let's take a tour from one side of Branson Strip to the other, ending in downtown Branson. I'm Chris with Branson's Best Shows. Now imagine driving right past an incredible attraction or show on the Branson Strip without even realizing it was there. Don't let this happen to you. I'm here to take you on an epic tour of the entire Branson Strip. Oh, by the way, there's the Redneck Comedy Bus Tour. Laugh your way through the Ozarks at 10 a.m. and 1 p.m. Now, if you made a left at this light, you would get to Pierce Harris Theater, the Hamner's Theater, Sight and Sound Theater, and the IMAX Entertainment Complex. Now, going through the light, we have IHOP, which is open after the shows and a great place to grab a bite to eat. Speaking of food, you have Cracker Barrel on the left for all your southern food favorites from breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Also, you might want to check out the Olive Garden. And we're coming to our first theater, which is Nashville Roadhouse Theater, featuring Stevie Lee Woods. Now, if you see on the right, way up in the air, that's Bigfoot's The Gravity Ball. It's a 200-foot freefall ride that seats up to eight riders. Dickerson Crafts Mall is one of the oldest crafts mall in Branson. And on the left, you have the Dinosaur Museum, featuring 45 life-size dinosaurs. The Toy Museum consists of six museums, featuring different toy collections. Extreme Racing features the longest high-speed racing kart track in North America. And now we're coming to the first track, which features the Lumberjack, which was the original high-rise go-kart track in Branson. Now, over the summer, you'll want to visit on the left, Whitewater. This is Branson's water park featuring 2 million gallons of fun and 13 acres of water rides, slides, and wave pools. Float your cares away on the Aloha River, splash with the little ones in Coconut Cove. It's a whole lot of fun. Now, as many of you know, the Dutton Theater had a fire last year. They are now open, but finishing up the front with a total redesign featuring decorative towers and canopy, it'll be really nice. On the left, you have Mickey Gilly's Shanghai Theater featuring the amazing acrobats of Shanghai and of course, Rick Thomas's magic. The Hughes Brothers Theater is a cast of 50 uniquely talented entertainers that brings you an experience you can't miss. Of course, Andy's Frozen Custard, an attraction of its own. And coming up on the left is a track that features the Ferris wheel that was brought directly from the Chicago Pier. It also has the heavy metal track ride. Professor's Hacker's Lost Treasure Golf. And on the right, we have Ripley's Believe It or Not. Now that has eight theme galleries containing animal oddities, pop culture memorabilia, interactive games, and stories of people and places that are truly incredible, believe it or not. If you're wanting high flying fun, Branson Helicopter Tours, everything from an intro experience tour to a deluxe Branson tour, depending on your budget. Go ahead and bop the subscribe and like buttons because it'll help Branson continue to thrive by letting others know about it on YouTube. Now with Retromania, you'll feel like you stepped back in the 80s. They have a putt-putt course with your favorite rockers, haunted house, and free classic 80s arcade games. Now, if you make a ride at this light, you will see the Branson Famous Theater, the showboat Branson Bell, which my family just went on and had a ton of fun, and of course, the Table Rock Dam. Now, as we go through this light, you have the Branson Titanic Museum, which has over 400 priceless artifacts and historical treasures, interactive exhibits that you'll love, like uh, seeing how long you can keep your hands in ice cold water. A mission includes an audio tour. Here we have Clay Cooper's Theater, home of Clay himself, number one hits of the 60s, the Hay Goods, Dean Z, and much more. Beyond the Lens is packed with over 150 interactive exhibits, including four-story high, state-of-the-art flying adventure. Now the Hollywood Wax Museum Complex, you start here with Shoot for the Stars Mini Golf, and then at the Wax Museum itself, you can take selfies and learn about the stars, you have Hannah's Maze of Mirrors and the Castle of Chaos. And brand new this year is Digtown and includes attractions for three and four year olds as well as older kids. Cheddar's is a great place to grab a meal between shows. And of course, the Presley's Theater, the original show on the strip, entertaining families since 1967. Now on the left is our sponsor theater, the Americana Theater, featuring C.J. Newsom and Terry Sanders, along with America's Top Country Hits, Elvis Story of a King, and Awesome 80s. You can get half price tickets by using the promo code BBS. See more in our description. 
Now, WonderWorks is an amusement park for the mind with over 48,000 square feet of what they call edutainment. Longhorn Steakhouse is my family's favorite place to get a steak. And Cakes and Creams is a great 50s style diner that serves burgers and shakes. Now the Branson Aquarium has a vast view of a gorgeous coral reef teeming with tropical marine life. Also a free fountain show out front every half hour. Here is King's Castle featuring the ultimate 70s shows, Jersey Nights, Irish Tenors, and many more. Now we're coming up on the Andy Williams Theater and it's currently closed, but there are rumors that someone may be purchasing it. But you know how rumors are. Now this track coming up is a track that features the Wild Woody, a four-story tall track and it looks and feels like an oversized wooden roller coaster. There's great shopping at the Tanger Outlet with over 75 brand name designer outlets, including Vera Bradley, Under Armour, Banana Republic Factory, and the Disney Store. Denny's Restaurant is also open after the shows. Here we have Ripley's Super Fun Zone featuring Laser Tag Arena and a 12,000 square foot interactive outdoor maze. Now, if you'd like to zip around the Ozark Hills, the Branson Coaster is your ticket with one or two person sleds controlling your own speed as you race down the mountain. And no vacation is complete without an emergency trip to Walmart, conveniently located in the middle of the strip. If you'd like to pet a lemur or feed a shark, you can do that at Branson's Wild World. And when you're hungry at 2 a.m., here is Taco Bell. Now, the Grand Country Resorts on the left is more than just a place to stay. It has an amazing water park called Splash Country. This indoor and outdoor water park offers endless fun with a three-story treehouse. Oh, the duck tours are here. On-site dining options include Grand Country Buffet, Papa Grand's Pizza, and the Mining Company Grill. Guests also have access to the Fun Spot, an entertainment center with indoor go-karts, laser tags, arcade games, bumper cars, and indoor and outdoor mini golf course. Pick up all your Trump merchandise here at the Trump Depot. And of course, on the left-hand side, we have the Music City Center, now run by a church, but original theater the Haygood started their post-Silver Dollar City career. God and Country on the right, featuring Jerry Presley, plus many other shows. Applebee's, another spot to grab a bite after the show. And the best hamburger in town is Billy Bob's and my mom's favorite. TNT Old Time Photos ran by our good friends the Tonocos and so much fun. And the Panera Bread Company has moved to the Strip. Now on the right we have Dick Clark's Theater featuring Legends and Concert, Six, and Buckets and Boards. A great dinner show is Dolly Parton's Stampede, and Dolly claims it's the most fun place you'll eat in Branson, and she guarantees it. Even if you don't attend the show, stop by and say hi to the horses, free of charge. Now coming up on the hill, we have Fritz's Adventure. It offers at 80,000 square feet of explorable space. The treetop course includes 45 obstacles, zip lines, suspension bridge, a whole lot of fun. Now Hearts Donuts on the right is the rebel of all donuts, like none you've ever experienced. As we go through the light, we have Happy Joe's Pizza and Ice Cream Parlor, serving signature pizzas, creative sandwiches, delicious pasta, and a family-friendly atmosphere. On the left is the original place of the Engler Block before the 2012 tornado, now featuring the Auto and Farm Museum, having two acres of vintage farm equipment vehicles from 1900s to 2000s. Oop, there's Dunkin' Donuts and Baskin Robbins. Get your coffee and ice cream fix. and the Veterans Memorial Museum with over 2,000 exhibits progressing through the wars of the 20th century. On the right, you see the Methodist Church. Now from this point to the downtown Branson, there's not much to see, but I realized that the temperature outside while I'm filming this is 101 degrees. And my camera is sitting on the roof of my car and sitting at this light here, I realized uh, the camera may not be able to handle that kind of heat. And of course, as I went through the light, it couldn't. Yep, shutting down due to overheating. But don't worry, we'll do this again soon. And make sure to check out my other great videos about Branson. And don't forget to like and subscribe.